Good morning, everybody. I have a quick update as far as the four minute video is concerned, the one about Paul Thorpe exposing a video of somebody vandalizing a church, and of course, then subsequently, and the more important part of it, there was a point where a man was arrested because he was defending himself against a Palestinian dickhead. Well, I actually found the channel that the person who was arrested was. Uh, I believe if I've got the name correct, and I'll be linking his video relating to the arrest in the description below. But I believe his name is Potkir as or Potkin Azamir official, if I recall correctly. And you'll have to forgive me. My kettle's boiled, and unfortunately I didn't break the old habit of pot noodle for breakfast. Anyway, he had put out a video showcasing basically what had happened. So, as you saw in the video, both from Paul Thorpe and what you'll see in his video as well, is that the Palestinian put his hands on Azamir first. And then all Azmir did was push his hand away. That was when he had 10 police officers, according to him, jump him and arrest him. I know, it, it, it's astounding. It's truly astounding that we can have people like this who are more than willing to... Um, who are more than willing to let a terrorist who one of these blonde bimbos was actually supposed to be looking for... He, she was shown basically where he was, he was in the demonstration, yet she chose not to arrest him. I wonder how Code of Conduct is going to take that, madam. But you would rather arrest a patriot who is defending himself. Please explain that one. I know you won't. But what it does prove more than anything else is that we have even bigger evidence, as far as the video that I showed yesterday is concerned from Paul Thorpe, that these guys really are two-tier policing wankers. And quite frankly, I think if they keep this up, my God, the 1st of June, there is going to be so much evidence against the police. It'll be extremely difficult for anybody with even half a brain cell to not see the two-tier treachery that we're seeing from a Metropolitan Police.